What's up guys, welcome back to Ultimate MMA Plus, uh, here with my assistant, pro fighter Harris Bonfiglio. Uh, we're going to finish part three of the series we've been working the past couple weeks. Uh, we are in class today again, uh, so lay down. So, the first technique we did was a north-south choke. Second thing we did, if he defended the north-south choke, is went for the Kimura. Now he's going to defend the Kimura. So, I'm in here, look for my north-south choke, boom. He's defending, I can't really get, he's pushing on my neck. I switch off, come to my Kimura grip, but he grabs. I'm not gonna <coughs> fight this, no reason to fight it, and I can't trap the arm. I'm not gonna rip this off, I'm not gonna be bothered. So what I'm gonna do is, come this way. And I'm gonna turn my palm up again like we did before. Same thing when we got this. I'm gonna come under the head, and I'm gonna go palm to palm. So the one under the head, this palm down, the one on the arm is going to be palm up. I'm not around his neck. I kind of go around like where his temples are here a little and here. I'm going to drop my shoulder into the back of his head here. <coughs> and I can finish right here. Boom. But some of you guys are going to be new to this, so they're not going to tap. So you're going to have to step up with the same side where his head is and then here. But once you get good, you don't need it. Well, you just finish right in there. All right? Yeah. Okay, so let's go this way. So I'm inside control. I'm gonna look for my north. This is this is what it means when you're thinking three moves ahead. Here, I already know that if all these moves fail, I already know what I'm gonna do. He starts pushing on my neck, making me uncomfortable. So look, I do the same thing here, here. You feel the pressure? He's got a lot of pressure on him. I look for the Kimura grip, but he grabbed. So I drop down to my knee. I can leave this leg up if you want more power. I don't need the leg, so I always just come around, and then I just drop it. I'm going to take this arm and put it deeper into his armpit. So when I'm in here, look, here, feel it? And then here, just like this. If I need more power, then I step this up, and then I come here. Come this angle. <clears throat> here. Here. It's legal in ADCC rules. <clears throat> not an IBJJ. He starts pushing on my neck. Here. Here. He grabs his wrist. So I know I don't really have the Kimura here. <clears throat> I can fight it and get it. But let's just say I'm tired. Come around here. Here. Bring this in his armpit and look, boom. If I was in IBJJF here, then I would just come around and grab the wrist, sit him up, and just take the back. But I want to go over the neck crank today, not the back kick. One more with your head on this side. Last one. Here. Looking for the north south choke. I got good pressure. I want to get palm to palm. I pummel in. Here. He grabs. Come underneath. See how I dipped? See how I was up here? I want to get my chest on his back. See that? So some of you guys are going to grab like this and he's going to fall. So when I have this, I'm on his shoulder. When I switch, I put my back on his back and then finish. You guys got it? That was part three, guys. We did a north south choke. We switched to a Kimura. He grabs his wrist. We switched to the neck crank. Hope you guys like. Definitely hit subscribe. Leave us a comment if you like this series. 
and definitely give us a thumbs up. Thanks, guys. We'll see you back for some more jujitsu next week. Thanks again. All right, guys, on three. One, two.